Howdy. I have a very useful feature in the project browser today. So let's get straight to it. Um, here's the project browser. You can see that um, the, I mean, it looks as, as it usually does. There's two things that I've added this beta update. So uh, the first one, it's pretty simple. If you hold command on a Mac or control on Windows, um, you can open in a new tab. So you stay where you are and then it opens in a new tab. So we can do that a few times. Um, and that's just super handy to have. Um, the second one is filtering, searching. So a couple of people requested to be able to filter this. It was, it was on my radar as well as something that would be quite useful. So uh, you can see this button here is a search button. You can click that. If you're on a tablet, you'll need to click that. Um, but if you have a keyboard attached, you don't need to click that. As long as you're using this window, um, then I've implemented something that is reminiscent of a program I used to use or a plugin I used to use for Winamp if you were ever a Windows user and you used Winamp. Um, there was a plugin, a database management plugin called Mexp. Uh, I can't remember who made it. Might have been Johan something. I'm probably getting that wrong. But uh, he did an amazing, ver amazing um, job on that plugin. But one of the killer features that I haven't seen re reproduced anywhere else was that when you're browsing your database, you don't need to click on a search field. You can just start typing. And that's what you can do here as well. So as soon as you start typing, it goes into a search mode. It activates the search bar that wasn't visible before and it starts filtering everything. So I can backspace out of that and you can see it's stopping filtering. So I'll say, um, let's look at for advice. Oh, I spelled it wrong, but advice. And I see this article, advice for students considering an honors year. Um, let me try uh, the word the. And I get everything with the word the. Now you can clear that by clicking this X. Do it again. You can clear that by clicking the search button. So if you click the search button, then you realize, oh, I didn't actually want to do a search, just click it again. But you can also, keeping with the keyboard theme, um, start typing and then just hit escape as well. Now, if you start uh, searching something, um, and then you go into a folder, it will keep that search active for that folder. So inside this folder, I don't have anything with the word the in it, but if I hit escape, I now see everything within that folder. Um, the one thing that we've lost for now, um, just because I broke it, is that if you open a file and then you go back, it won't highlight that file anymore, but it will keep the scroll position still, but it just won't highlight the file. I'll bring that back in the next update. That's it. Hopefully you guys love it. I think those are two kind of killer features, just searching super easily um, and opening in a new tab. I know they've already helped me a lot. That's it guys. See you later.